Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be reviewing set 21172. This is the Ruin Portal, has 316 pieces, and has four minifigures, including the animals there. First, let's look at the minifigures, starting with Steve. In the set, he does come with Witherite armor, I believe that's what it's called. Correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. Um, he does have a knight, he does have a, pick, a diamond pickaxe. And also an iron sword here, so you get to choose which one you want him to have. Or, of course, you know, if you really wanted to, why not make him dual wield a diamond pickaxe and an iron sword? Like, it's <laughs> like, why not? Of course, underneath the helmet is just the usual Minecraft Steve head and just the torso. So nothing special. But the armor is cool. <laughs> And then got a Wither Skeleton right here. This guy is creepily tall with his skinny, long, black legs. And just has a black torso and arms. Has a wither I, Witherite sword? I don't know. You can tell they're these two swords are different just because they're slightly different shades of gray. This one's a bit darker. So that's really the only way you can tell the difference. And you also get a baby sheep, which its wool is dyed purple. Don't ask me why, I have no idea. And of course a baby hoglin, whatever the heck a hoglin is. I guess it's a hog mixed with a goblin? A hoglin? I don't know. <laughs> um, so yeah, it has tusks in the front. You can open its, you can move its head up and down, so... That's cool. And has two blocks here, a golden block, and whatever this is supposed to be. Tell me what this is in the comments down below, please, because I do not know. And then we got the actual build itself, which this is a $30 set, guys. This is not a $40 set. Like, this is a $30 set, and you compare it to a Star Wars set that is also $30, and that set has, like, what, half as many pieces? And you can't say, well, this set has a lot of small pieces. Because the Star Wars sets have more small pieces than this. So this has, like, a lot more bigger pieces. So that's pretty much just the reason I like Minecraft so much. It just seems like such a steal compared to other themes like Star Wars. Um, I mean, of course, minifigure-wise, you're pretty much getting the same thing over and over again. Because, you know, they don't got a lot of skins variation right just mostly just alex and steve but yeah it's a really nice set really big really like it i would definitely recommend it but let's actually get into the set here it has this fire tree i don't know it's a red tree from the nether there has a little bit of blue some weird color weird color meshing but that's what the nether looks like so some coloring you wouldn't really necessarily see in a lot of other sets um Make, just mixed together like this just looks a little weird <laughs> and then we got on the other side a screen just like normal minecraft you also get an oven there and if you want it to make it look like it's not burning you just switch that side get a little lamp and plant so yeah night got the hot lava coming down one side and water coming down the other side to make it look like they're opposites got a couple uh differently colored mushrooms in the nether but let's talk about the main play function in this thing, because it's actually pretty cool. So you can, of course, you can slide this up right here, and the portal's on. And that that, just, that looks really cool as it is right there. Or if you pull this lever up, it'll slide down. It's a pretty simple function. You can see inside of here, you can see a little Technic thing. When I move the lever, when I move the lever on the other side, that goes up. Which lets this slide down, which lets that, which makes the portal go down. So it's it's, just, it's a nice little neat function. I like how in each, every single one of these Minecraft sets, you just pack in a little different, a little different uh, play function. It's just really cool. The different play functions they pack into these Minecraft sets. Just pull that up and slides down. And well, you might say, well, it's off. So why is it complete? Well, you can actually take this apart and make it look like a ruined portal. So you can just stick that down there or wherever you want. There, there, you know. These are just built in segments of a 
two by two brick attached to whatever these bricks are called with the two studs on top. So that's that's a cool play function. Then it's a ruin portal, just like the name of the set, the ruin portal. So also these can come off and you can attach these wherever you want, obviously. Just a two by two brick attached to, I think people have these called jumper plates. That it's just a lot of cool different customizability customability with this set, and a lot of super neat play features. Um, well, not necessarily a lot, pretty much just one, but it's a really cool play feature. <laughs> um, I would highly recommend this set. If you do not buy Lego Minecraft, buy Lego Minecraft. It's really good. Don't go. Well, you might as well just play the video game because they're different. They're not the they're not the same thing. So yeah, really cool set. I highly recommend this one, which I mean, I really, I highly recommend pretty much all the Minecraft sets I've bought so far. So it's not saying much, but yeah, <laughs> really good deal on this one. Really like it. So just like that. It's a cool play feature. It's opposite on both sides. It's just, it's just cool. It's like a parallel build or whatever. Not parallel, but you know, you get the point. And you can just attach your blocks on that side however the hoglin i mean this the nether is actually the nether segment is just a little bit bigger than the normal world segment because it has that what, it was eight by eight right six by six so it has one of these uh coral like teal teal blue as one of these teal blue six by sixes on this side so it makes it a little bit longer on this side so they're not quite the same size, and of course this side has a tree on it. But yeah, it's just really cool. Pair, uh, that's pretty much the same on each side. So, highly re recommend it. If you don't have it, and you want to buy LEGO Minecraft, buy this set. Buy any, pretty much any LEGO Minecraft set. Buy the Mushroom House, the Abandoned Mine's another really good one. Which, you know, these are like, uh, those are sets I own, of course. So I'm recommending those, I'm not really... I'm not going to recommend sets that I don't own because I can't really recommend sets that I don't own to other people. But anyways, buy this set. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.